I had a, a little bit tough time getting a job because uh, the market was kind of difficult for my specific area. I mean, if you're a builder or a painter, yes, you would have work. But for for someone who had like a economic background but didn't go on to for, do further studies within the, the area, a little bit more difficult. <laughs> I got myself a, a, a job driving a delivery truck uh, in Stockholm. And the, the very first job I did was, because um, it was one of those manpower things where the company actually rents out drivers to other companies who need extra people because of you know people being sick or whatever. So the, the very first job I did for that company was actually de delivering ice cream. I got there at I think like five o'clock in the morning, loading the truck up with the ice cream, and then just started doing my deliveries. And um, it was like. I'd never done that before, so obviously it took a little while, uh, probably longer than you know that it should have. But I was done around six in the evening, and uh, by that time when I got back, there was no one at the, the, the depot where I could leave my paperwork and all that stuff. So I just dropped the, the car off, brought my paperwork with me back home, and decided to bring it in the next day. The phone rings, and it's it's my boss at the manpower thing. Manpower company, and he said, "Well, did you bring the paperwork work with you back home?" I said, "Yeah, I did." I said, "All right, I'm gonna come over and pick it up because they don't want you to come back." <laughs> so, oh, really? Uh, yeah, somebody complained about your beard and stuff. Apparently, uh, I did a really good job, but I don't know. There was something about the beard, I guess. <laughs>